Hey, what's up guys? VMG here, and we're back today to bring you more Hearts of Iron 4 The Diamond League with Donnie the Dude and Gamakaze. Hello. Hello! Yes, last time, the epic peace treaty of, well, the entire world pretty much, except the United States. They stayed neutral, and we can't accept that, so they die. Not this episode, but they will die soon. Let's hit play. This episode- oh shit. <laughs> we hadn't gone through Oh that. yeah, we didn't actually do that. Stuff. All this stuff, yep. <laughs> but yeah, this episode, basically just kind of rebuilding and preparing for the war with America, I think. At least that's what I'm going to be doing. Do we know when we last had peace? It Does anybody know? Has it been a decade? Has it been ten uh, years of constant war? Don't know. Let's see, we declare war on, uh, on Germany, or something happened there, then the Soviet Union... Uh, and then Sinkang. I think we may have had like a month or two of peace, but the rest of it was just sort of war. Because we didn't expect to be brought into the ally, the World War II, by Sinkang. Oh, so. yeah, by the way, a, a commenter put this perfectly. It doesn't matter what I did during the war. You started the goddamn war, so it doesn't matter if I brought in Brazil. You brought in the allies. <laughs> so this is... It doesn't matter, okay? <laughs> it's all your fault. That's that's a that's a that's a fair point. Yeah, it may have been me with the whole sinking <laughs> thing. Right. Well, I mean, we had no way of knowing. Well, my experience should have told me that's what would have happened, but I think I chose to ignore that. Nah, it, it made for it made for good good TV. <laughs> <laughs> I all have. Right. So I'm gonna men. build up a whole bunch of uh, infrastructure in Canada and other things. Oh crap, game lag. Yep, I've got that. Shit, did it crash? No. Is this our first crash of the series? It's, it's kind of chugging along. Oh, uh, it's just completely stopped for me. And it's back. Completely, completely stopped, stopped for me. There it is. Oh, there it is. Okay, I thought we just had our first crash. Alright. Some would I'm call gonna... that an omen, but uh, I'm, not, I'm not particularly superstitious. Uh, of what? The United States winning and beating us? That would be amazing. That would be the best end of this series ever. No, that would be an awful ending. <laughs> that'd be great. I think Give it two episodes, it. guys. The US will go from this to all of the world. Yeah. That's just what the US does, man. I mean, I could call in <laughs> Venezuela at any point. They... They're still willing to join. Any no time. Venezuela. I need some naval bases. Right. Here for supply. I'll get two really high level ones. So, dump all men into one solitary army. Doesn't matter who you are. <clears throat> you're going into oh, the one army. You've got lines in my land. Move them back to yours. <laughs> oh, that, ah, that's so old. That was back when yeah. I was the only person in Canada. <laughs> Alright, there we go. So everybody, all 220 divisions, will push all the way down through the US. You've got 220 divisions? 220 divisions, yes. I've got 52. <laughs> what? How, how <laughs> have you been fighting this war? <laughs> because we have awesome troops. They are just small in number. <laughs> I think I've got like... 90 some divisions. Wow, I, I'm Polish terrible lives power. have saved us in Europe so many times. Like, I, <laughs> I'm fairly sure about 100. No, of I, I've lost some troops along the way. I think I had like 60 some at some point. I just haven't been training them because I've been so low on manpower. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so many troops crossing the Atlantic. I got 54 Coast Guards. They're all just here. I got over 100 Coast Guard divisions. I. What do I do with these guys? <laughs> I'm there. What the hell? It's not letting me deploy my troops in Canada. Do you have access through us? I'm sure you do. Oh, well, maybe not. Uh, not now that we're not at war. I mean, we're maybe. faction members. You should have. Should, but it's still not letting me deploy my troops or set them to be deployed in Canada. Well, get on that. Come on, we're. T this is like the, I don't know the what one there, man. I'm, I'm building naval provinces into there. I mean, no, my troops can move into there. I just can't deploy them if I'm training them. I think. All. Oh, I mean, they yeah, my troops are moving while training. Every province in eastern Canada will no, have. No, I, I can't set them to be spawned in Canada. Is what I'm oh, trying to no. say. 
You don't own it. Oh, no, you, you have to connect. Yeah. I mean, you own it, but it's not, yeah. Exactly. Oh, it's not connected to my capital? Pretty much? Yeah. Okay, I got you. I'm following. I guess I think... Uh, I, I think? Maybe? Are you building artillery at all? Oh, I am, and I'm not even using it. <laughs> I haven't been using it the whole time. Oh, yeah, I guess there's detachments in there. You haven't been using artillery. Did I hear that right? I'm also wanting to... No, I misunderstood how I had my division set up. I was using it, just not the way I thought I was. Okay, good. Instead of support divisions, I was using them as actually divisions within the, uh, like, I don't know, command group. I'm not sure how you go about it, but... <clears throat> well, I am going to make super heavy battleships. I don't know how well they'll work in war. Don't know if I'll even use them, but I'm going to give them a try. And what else do I need in my stockpiles? I've got 40,000 artillery pieces, nearly 200,000 guns... 15,000 trucks. Need more tanks, maybe? I don't know. Hmm. I'm building super heavy battleships, destroyers, and submarines. And convoys. Lots and lots of convoys. <clears throat> and actually, I've got more dockyards now. I've never... Uh, honestly, I've never used mechanized divisions. Is that something I should look into? I've got mech 3 comboed with my tanks. I didn't even know that was a thing. I mean, I know, like, mechanized is good, but for some reason I never get it. Like, it's... For some reason I just view it as a hassle to mm. pe put people in armored trucks and have machine guns on them. Like, I don't know why. Yeah, oh, I mean, no, I no, I... Yeah, I know mechanized. Yeah, I use mechanized. They work pretty well. I thought you meant, like, infantry mechanized. Like, Iron Man style. <laughs> What? Is that that's a thing? why I was confused. No, that's why I was confused. I'd never heard of them before. But no, I use mechani mechanized. They're pretty good. I like how if Romania doesn't build any ports, all of his supply has to come through us. No, I'm building ports right now, <laughs> yeah. man. Okay. I'm building a whole bunch of shit. I'm building airports, uh, radar stations, anti-air. Soviet Union offers mm -hmm. protection. After the Soviet Ooh. Union claimed their rights to eastern Poland, we assume another attack is impended. However, a recent offer from the Soviets indicate otherwise. Apparently, provided we cede the claimed territory, uh, they will let us join an alliance. <laughs> Furthermore, they promised in the event of war with Germany, we will be compensated for the loss being granted. Oh my god! Wow. So I could give Russia... Some land, if I wanted. Do it. <laughs> see what happens. I could yeah, give them my you, eastern core land. Do it. See what happens. Maybe they exist again. And you can go crush them. Absolutely not. The Russian Empire gets the event. Poland refuses. Let's see what they do. Let's see what the all my troops are in America, but let's see what they do. May I kill them? So you're a puppet. I yeah, mean, they're a puppet. Well, right. can you break away if you're a puppet? I don't that, know that you can. Is that something? That I mean, yeah, you can, but you need like. It's, I don't think you have the DLC to be able to do so. Oh, probably not. I could guarantee their independence. <laughs> Russian Empire. <laughs> what should I... What should I do? Right, I'm gonna need more manpower for this war, so I'm, I think I'm gonna go to... Uh, extensive conscription. I'm or, gonna release... Which one's the bigger one? Oh no, I have to be at war to go to all, all, oh, all, all, all adults. I'm already school. on all adults. <laughs> I I was holding out, but now that I know that Poland has shit tons of men, and so do you, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna do it. I'm like I'm gonna get some more guys. I'm gonna release the nation of Kenya. That's Welcome the to the world, Kenya. Hmm. They're not a puppet; they're just released. I, I so never mind. I just lost Kenya. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome, Kenya. <laughs> That's. Let's turn you fascist. Jesus. They're not fascist? No, I just released them. I thought it would give me an option for puppet. Mm. No, no, well. That's fine. <coughs> I won't be releasing <laughs> Canada then. Good plan. Yeah, I wouldn't. Unassigned divisions. Where the hell? Where did these guys come from? <coughs> all these up. 
up. I'm making a port on every part of the coastline in Canada. Yeah, I'm doing the same thing. <laughs> I'm just making two level 10 ports in my lands. That's... <clears throat> is that gonna be enough? I mean, you'll be supplied through our ports as well, so hopefully all together. Yeah. Right. We'll have enough supply. I think that should be enough. And also, I'm increasing the uh, infrastructure in Canada all the way to 10. In also, every province I own. Air yeah, bases. I Very important. Oh yeah, I've got a level 10 air base getting built as well. South Ontario, St. Lawrence, uh, New Brunswick, Nova Scotia. The airports go up real quick. Yeah, my national focus that I uh, set it on is Holy construction crap. engineering, so... Yeah, I have the same. I literally have uh, 100 extra factories that I'm not using. Yeah, I had I that. Had, you know, it's amazing when you notice. conquer most of the world that you just have... Fins left Infinite over. factories, yeah. Oh wait, I'm not- I'm not producing support equipment. Oh no, there it is. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I was very surprised there for a moment. <clears throat> um, I'll produce so some heavy fighters. Quiet now. Yeah, I know. We're just sitting here. <laughs> Peace. It's great. Alright, I'm gonna go to the air and I'm gonna disband all the Air Force. Then I can re reassign them, uh, back in America. Yeah, that's what I'm doing as well. <clears throat> Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing with mine. You know, I think I there's... We'll have to look at it. There's a famous quote that was uh, said uh, during uh, Nazi Germany, the Holocaust. It's like, uh, they, they came for the communists. I didn't speak out because I wanted a communist. They came for the socialists. I didn't speak out because I wasn't a socialist. They came for the Jews. I didn't speak out because I wasn't a Jew. Then they came for me, and there was no one left to speak out. That's America, except they came for Russia, Germany, and the Allies, and I didn't do anything. And now I'm on my own. I think that's very appropriate. <laughs> Where did I have Well, we are playing with today? historical focuses, so. Are we? They just we went really isolationist. I thought we turned that off. I think we turned it off. We definitely yeah. turned that off. That's, right? that's what I said. That's what I said. We're not playing. Oh, if I said we are playing. No, I said we're not. Yeah. Use Where your ears, we? man. Was my air force. Oh, sure I'm making is. infinite planes right now, so we're 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 set. I've got like ten thousand in reserve. Yeah, yeah. The United States is not gonna have any air superiority at all very soon. <clears throat> For some reason, I've just got twenty guys sitting in one spot. All right, let's actually. I can. Um, Nova Scotia. Select all my. That is something I should do. Uh, do I have by type. new model jet fighters? Yeah. Why not? Let's get those going. Not a bad plan. Yeah, that's what I'm using as well. I've got a mix of like rocket uh, interceptors and I don't um, use those. jet fighters. Well, I haven't got this far, so I'm just trying everything. Yeah, fair <laughs> enough. I'm just going to make all these guys into tanks, I think. There we go. I've got the uh, stuff to do it, anyways. Oh, I've still got uh, my recruited infantry, or my... Uh, the infantry that uh, Bulgaria gave me. Fighting for me. There you go. Mm -hmm. They're still doing stuff, but... Yeah, unfortunately, fine. the channel they were watching this on died. So... <laughs> yeah. That is true. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and we haven't said, uh, yeah, it's official. The YouTube got back to Donnie, and, well. Oh, yeah. I'll let him tell you back. if he wants to. Yeah. That's that's awful. But I'm willing to record with you guys. It doesn't matter much to me. Yeah. <sighs> so everyone in the comments down below say thank you, Donnie, for staying with us. Okay? There we go. And also, oh. go spam YouTube. Or don't spam them, but no, go tell yeah. them they're assholes for taking Donnie's channel. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I don't know that I talked to a human in the whole process, mm -hmm. but that's all right. I'm going to pick up archery. Yep. It's fun. Oh, yeah. shit. They have paratroopers. <clears throat> the United States says, not archers. <laughs> what? The U.S. has archers? We're doomed. Pull out. Oh, no. 
Holy crap! Come on, I don't, I don't have anything else I want to build with my military factories. I, uh, I, I've just got infinite stuff. I guess I could get more support equipment. Sure. All of the factories. Oh, now I'm starting to use the uh, the factories that are destroyed. And I'm Jets, still repairing those. Fine. Strap bombers. Mm -hmm. That's my new tech on that. Hope you're all enjoying this, guys. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> well, I mean, it's necessary, you know? We're finally at peace. We can actually rebuild and repair and things. Yeah. I think I and... still have troops attempting to get here. And the attrition's killing them because the infrastructure hasn't quite got there yet. Make... I'm gonna make those. My division, I shall like have that. four... That's... Is that medium? What's medium doing there? Right. I shall have modern tanks. All my tank divisions will now be modern. And they'll have two trucks, three trucks, and two mechanized. Mm, yes, I will. That's mine. I'm doing five mech and then modern. Five divisions, yeah. Infantry's fine. Horses. Uh, let's let's get <clears throat> max horse in this. How many horses can I have? There we go. Twenty combat whiff. We shall have support artillery. We shall have field hospitals and engineering company. Uh, support rocket artillery. We'll have that yeah. in there. Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, my cavalry divisions now have, like, 12,000 men in them. Mm. There you go. My cavalry were still rolling with, uh, let's see. Where does it say how many guys yeah. you've got? I don't have many more. I got rid of them. They were ro rolling with 3,000 dudes. <laughs> By the four times, <laughs> four times the size. Yep. How did you find all those horses? That's exactly what I was thinking. Well, we own all We're of Europe now, time. so... Probably import some oh, from right. Japan That's... and China. By the way, we might as well get this out the way. Uh, Asia is the territory of Bohemia and Romania. So they have the say whether we actually go to war with Japan. What are your yeah, thoughts, Yeah, we don't guys? go to war with Japan. They're fascist. Yeah. We leave them alone. Yeah, not right now, at least. Not yeah. Like we're building up for the United States. Exactly. And All right, you so have your answer. something else we need to decide upon is uh, where are you going to put your navy, Poland? Because I'm thinking I'll put mine on the the coast towards Asia, and you put yours on the east coast. Yeah. Because we're going to have to fight their navy as well. Uh, I I'm going to put all my people. Where's like the biggest ports? This pro probably made like a ton of gigantic ports here. Yeah, I'll have my main port will be based out of here. And I'm going to have them all just patrolling uh, the eastern seaboard, pretty much. Yep. The Newfoundland Sea, eastern seaboard, and uh, Florida coast. Yep. And I ha I'm i going to have two different, uh, two separate navies. Uh, one's going to just patrol the northwestern coast, western seaboard, and the Mexican coast. And the other one's going to do North Pacific, Northeast Pacific, and North Central Pacific. My carrier research is going to take 20 days to get the first level of carriers. <laughs> <laughs> there this you is go. Such a turnaround from the from part one. Do you guys want to go to speed four? Because you know we're just we sort of preparing. Can. I'm just waiting for my guys to cross the world and meet up everywhere. Can't do. Uh, I'm waiting for infrastructure. I'm trying yep. to. How is it? Right. Crit right click. I've just been messing this up. Right. Hopefully people aren't just shouting at me in the comments. Hmm. They probably are. Where did I put my they always are. You have, have you ever seen my comment section? So many people yes. shouting at me. <laughs> you need to reply to your comments, man. Don't I say that's here. God, no, don't listen <laughs> yeah, to some <yeah>. folks. <laughs> no, I take it back. Don't don't listen to me. I don't know what I'm doing. You don't run my <laughs> channel. I reply <laughs> to, to my channel. I'll there. answer all of your comments. All of them. Spam, my, my, folks spam my video with all the comments. I'll, I'll reply to as many as I can. Okay, if you want an answer to something... Go to VMG. There you go. He'll talk to you. <laughs> yeah, come over to my channel. Where the hell did they put my airbase? Because I've been building one here, and I can't find where it is on the map to click on it. That is an airbase, right? Yeah. It should be right there. I don't see it. Uh, I see some radars that I built. But I don't see anything else. Hmm. Carrier 1 research complete. Awesome. Where did it put my... Do you have Maybe. the uh, research to go along with that? You know, the uh, <clears throat> like carrier fighters and stuff? 
No, we'll get there. Not before the end of the Let's Play, but we'll get there. Yeah. We'll get there off screen. I've got 14 okay. nukes. Ready to yeah, says, nuke every part of the US. It says I have a level 10 fort here, or uh, airbase, but I can't see it. Is, is, is one of my troops... Oh, my, one of my troops is standing right on it, and yeah. I couldn't see it. Yep, he there was it is. Right. He was 100% right. So uh, they built a wall uh, across the Canadian border. <laughs> if you if, Have you noticed? Is that really? Yeah, they, there is defense. Dude! Defense. Dude, I was bullshitting. That's awesome. They have built a wall. God damn it. I, they, they elected Trump. So I don't... Wow, they really did. I don't, uh, <laughs> re well, I don't reply to many comments, but I read them, and people have been saying, oh, look, the U.S. has built a massive wall in the north. They're like, really? They did. And so they have. Well, it makes sense, I mean, wouldn't you? Yes, yes, I would. They're isolationist, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> How am I looking here? Right, we have 110 max preparation. Everyone's properly prepared. Uh, how do I... I've never trained. How do I? Ah, oh, that's how I start exercising. All right, I shall exercise like a million men on the the U.S. border. We'll see how well that goes. Hey, I'm not getting attrition anymore. That's nice. Sounds like the infrastructure must be coming in then. Yeah. Yeah, it's all. We need some more air bases. Quite nice. Because that that one can hold two thousand planes, but that is not near enough. I have got four hundred factories from construction. Before construction. Holy crap! Wow. I just looked at the United States' intel, and they have anywhere from twenty-three thousand planes to sixty-nine thousand planes. Jeez. So two thousand planes ain't gonna do shit. How Not many planes did you say bit. they have? Twenty-nine thousand to sixty thousand. I have like yeah. ten thousand. So can you guys make up the difference? I can. I've just got to have the air bases to put them there. I'm putting level 10 air bases in each uh, the four of my provinces, but I don't know if that th that'll be enough. That'll be uh, two, four, six. That'll be eight thousand planes. By the way, that I can uh, base. Be, according to me, it's over 20 minutes. Are we are we okay here? Oh, oh damn. Sorry. Yeah, let's pause. My bad. I wasn't uh, paying attention. Yeah. So thanks, thanks for watching. This is the the preparation to the United States war. We might have another preparation, preparation episode. Preparation H, I would say. <laughs> But yeah, that's it. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Later, guys. Later, guys.